Okay, what kind of person are you? I talked about having faith in God and diligently seeking Him, and that's just one aspect, but I want to broaden the discussion for just a moment. Matthew chapter 13 tells the story. Jesus, He's surrounded by crowds on the seashore there at Galilee, so He steps into a boat and begins to give them a sermon. I'm going to tell you the whole sermon. This is what He said. He said there's a farmer who went out to plant seed, and, and as he scattered seed, some fell by the wayside. The birds came and ate it up. Some fell among uh, on, on shallow earth or stony ground. And so what happened is it sprung up and then it died because it didn't have any root. Some fell among thorns, and, and as the thorns grew up, it choked it choked that seed and it didn't become fruitful, but then some fell in good ground and it bore fruit, some 30, some 60, some a hundredfold. Amen, have a good day. That was the whole message. Now, can you imagine that being your whole message? I mean, my goodness, he dismissed the crowd. Afterwards, the disciples said, what does that even mean? And why do you talk to them in parables or in stories? And Jesus made a profound statement. He said, because to you, it's given to know the mysteries of the kingdom of heaven. I'm asking the question, why? That seems unfair. Why would he explain it to his followers and not explain it to the crowds? Gonna explain that next time. That's Life in 90.